Atchison was founded by pro-slavery advocates, but soon anti-slavery settlers flooded to the area. There was a huge struggle to see who would control political power. The fight was crushing development of the new town. Into this divide, an up-and-coming political figure traveled to visit his cousin in Leavenworth. He came across the river at St. Joe and stopped in Troy where he made a speech to about a dozen people. The next day came to Atchison for a speech at the Methodist Church. The same day John Brown was hanged for his raid at Harper's Ferry, so the speech got little coverage in the newspapers. Several weeks later, the speech was given again in New York and published in papers all over the country. People who heard the speech in Kansas recognized it as the one they heard here. So the speech is known as the Cooper's Union speech from New York, but it was given first in Kansas and it launched that politician to the presidency of the United States. This is the House Divided, where Abraham Lincoln first declared, a house divided against itself cannot stand. Another one-minute wow. I'm Tom Pike.